All right, there should just be three videos left, including this. This one should be a really short one. Volume, okay? My name is Greg. Okay, so area is a two-dimensional object. Area, length times width, base times height. It's two-dimensional. So when I'm done, if this was 5 times 3, I'd say 15 units to the second power squared because it's two-dimensional, length times width, okay? But when you do volume, it's three-dimensional like a cube, okay? I'm going to draw a square. I'm going to try to go 45-degree angle, 45-degree angle, 45-degree angle. Then you go straight down. Okay, it's not perfect. And I'm not going to make it square. We won't make it a cube. But I'll, even though it looks kind of like a cube, I'll say this is three tall. And let's say it's two wide. But deep, it's, let's say, four deep. Okay, going that way. So that means this is four and this is four. Can you see that? Because uh, that's going to talk about surface area. But right now we're just doing it's a three-dimensional shape. So it's three-dimensional. So it's length times width times height. Okay, or I don't want to say it a different way. Just, just leave it at that. So let's say if we said the length is 4, the width going side to side is 2, and the height is 3. Okay, so 2 times 4 is 8, times 3 is 24. So it would be 24 units to the third power if you have a choice. A lot of times the multiple choice, they will go ahead and label it for you. There might be one or two questions if they're smart where they make you choose whether it's squared or cubed, okay? Because it's three-dimensional, it's units to the third power, okay? That's volume. Um, next we're going to do surface area, then mean, median, mode, and bar graphs. Hmm, will that be one or two? So there might be four videos left if I if mean, median, mode, and range is too much of a video by itself, and then I do, all right, we're almost done. 